Jack, saying that this is a boundary as a form of like avoiding having hard conversations is not a smart boundary. In fact, it's bad relational boundaries. Like saying, I have a boundary that we can't talk about deep things. That's that's where my boundary is. Yeah, Only shallow things. In our, you know, in, when you're in a relationship, not our relationship, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm married, he's married too. Uh, but in your relationships, it's about closeness. And if you are setting all of these things up in place, so that you don't have to defend the places where you don't want to, that can be problematic. Yeah, it's it's just a it's a cheap way of not dealing with with issues to say, well, I'm not going to deal with this because it's uncomfortable, so I'm going to call it a boundary so that I have some 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 ground to stand on here. It's it, it really doesn't doesn't help you out because it means that you're going to still have that issue, whatever that issue is. It's uh, boundaries are very important. You don't want people to to abuse you or, or to to misuse you, but. When we misuse the term boundary, that just becomes really difficult for us to, to be able to really work on ourselves. Boundaries is becoming a buzzword. And it's something that, that first of all, in counseling, we don't, I couldn't begin to express to you how many things go wrong because you don't have boundaries. Uh, but understand the very nature of what a boundary is. It's to keep things out or to keep things in. And communication, as far as like relating to the person you're in a relationship with, is not necessarily something that you want to keep out. A lot of times people do this and they 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 call it boundary for, for their mental health, but really uh, it's control. Uh, if you're a grown up, you can't live in a state of being controlled. No, I, mean, I, I have a, a child and I care about my child and I want my child to succeed and I want it to be safe. So I'm gonna wrap them in bubble wrap and throw them in the basement. No, that's not gonna help, right? And that's exactly what you're doing when you misuse the word boundary. You're just protecting yourself from actually going out there and living life and being the best version of yourself you can be. Yes, boundaries are important, but you can't use boundaries as, as a safety net for yourself just so you don't have to deal with issues. Boundaries rarely comes up uh, to suit your convenience or to suit your agenda. If you're in a relationship, have the, have the discussion of what your boundaries are and what your relationship boundaries are when it's not uh, with the vested interest in a certain direction. Uh, if you need help going through some patterns that may be problematic in your relationship, in your marriage, um, well, Jack does a lot of marriage therapy. I do a little bit myself, and we love working with you.